racism is not a problem, it's a reality. The public gets another chance to talk directly with Cleveland City Council about the issues they have with the police department. Council tonight holding the second stop on its listening tour tonight. News Channel 5's John Kosick was there and joins us live from the Justice Center. Yeah, Danita, this is the place where those changes will also be, ultimately be made. But Council first wanted to hear from the people what they think those changes should be. For the second time this month, members of Cleveland City Council ventured away from the comforts of City Hall and into the neighborhoods that came not to be heard, but to hear what issues residents have with police and how best to fix them. Some argue little has changed in the city and with its police over the last 50 years. We have a race issue. We've had a race issue since Huff, and it still exists. Kareem says a lot of that mistrust has to do with a move away from community policing when officers knew the people in the neighborhoods they were patrolling. Instead, they ride around in their uh, patrol cars with sunglasses on, looking like the worst of the gang members that I go past when I'm in any part of the city. There were calls for indictments in the case of Tamir Rice and cries of concern in relation to the case of Tanisha Anderson, a mentally ill woman who died last month in police custody. Samantha telling the 10 members of council tonight that she, like Tanisha, suffers from mental health issues. If I'm having a crisis situation and my family has to call 911, who's going to show up, an ambulance or the cops? Second of all, if the cops show up, am I going to get treated the same way Tanisha Anderson was, or am I going to get treated better than she was? And third, what are you going to do about the fact that either answer to number two is a huge problem? And that is an area that was highly critical in the DOJ report of Cleveland Police. The next of these listening tour stops will happen January 14th at the Elizabeth Baptist Church at 61st and Francis. Put in live at the Justice Center, John Kosick, News Channel 5.